Hey, Luis. So it looks like Spread Simple provided you a solution using the VLOOK function that you were looking for. And I'm offering a, a different way to, to approach this problem using the query function. So let me walk you through what that looks like. Okay, so let me hide this. So um, yeah, before I jump into the solution, I'll, I'll show you uh, how I set this up. So first you need to pre-format your, your data sources. Uh, so in this uh, import ranges worksheet that I created, um, you'll see that I imported two ranges. So something to note is that the column, uh, the columns need to match. So in your S2 worksheet, you had, you had uh, data up to column S. And in your first and your S1 worksheet, you only had data uh, up to column D. So I essentially just, uh, just grab the columns here and pasted it on your S1 worksheet. So it looks, so it's uh, identical, uh, even though that um, there's data missing for, for all of these new columns, right? And, but that's okay. So that's uh, the first bit that you need to take care of. Otherwise, otherwise the uh, the query uh, function won't work. Um, and then the other thing you need to do here, and this is just kind of like a preference, um, is I brought in um, the data on how I wanted to view it. So I wanted to first see um, the range from your S2 worksheet because it has all this all this data here. I don't know what it means, but it has all this data. And then secondly, I wanted to see the S1 with um, like these blank uh, values here. So, so you just have to pull in your S2 uh, starting from the A2 uh, cell, which has your headers. And then I brought in your S1 worksheet uh, starting from A3 because I don't want to pull in the header row. I want to just pull in the data rows, which uh, looks like this. So it looks nice and clean with one header and your data and one worksheet. Okay, so query function is where, where we um, essentially grab your data uh, that you want to view. And I think in your case, you wanted to view March rows. Uh, so it would look like this. Uh, so it would bring in Kanye West, Kim Kardashian, Kyler Jenner and Kyrie Irving all starts with K's. Um, interesting, interestingly enough, uh, and this is um, kind of the the date formatting that you need to do in order for the query to be able to read um, read your dates. And I got this solution from from Ben Collins on one of his posts. So I'll uh, I'll link to to that in the comments. But this is this is what the solution that I came up with without using VLOOKUP and having to do like the if error and the array formula. So hopefully that works. Um, if you have any questions, throw them in the comments.